Good afternoon, Cardinals. I'm Alexander Agnetti, president of the State University of New York at Plattsburgh, and it is my incredible pleasure to welcome you to our 2023 spring commencement for the School of Arts and Sciences. Please stand as able for our national anthem sung by the Plattsburgh State Gospel Choir. Be seated. As an institution that takes pride in conscious efforts toward building a more and inclusive community, we must take time to acknowledge that our campus is situated on land that belongs to the Iroquois, Western Abenaki, Mohican, and Mohawk peoples. We honor the original caretakers of this and surrounding land and offer respect to the Haudenosaunee who are still here. This land and body of water, now known as Lake Champlain, was inhabited and nurtured by these peoples for thousands of years. We must do the same to nurture and protect this sacred land. This statement is a mere fraction of the steps needed to fight against systemic indigenous erasure. We are settlers on, these, on their land, and we strive to be accountable by remembering this history, cultivating respect in our relationships with Indigenous natures and the land. Thank you. So once again, good afternoon, and it's my pleasure to introduce our platform guests by row. I ask that each guest stand when their name is called and that you please hold your applause until all have been introduced. First, Teba Azim, President of the Student Association and member of the University Council. <laughs> Malaika Salim, member of the class of 2023 and today's featured speaker. Dr. Ann Herzog, Provost and Senior Vice President for Academic Affairs. Next, New York Assemblyman D Billy Jones, 115th District. Gosh, I don't know why I had this sort of thing. Chris Rosenquist, Mayor of the City of Plattsburgh. James Coffey, a member of the SUNY Plattsburgh University Council. Martin Mannix, member of the University Council. Sydney Garant, member of the University Council. Matthew Veach, first vice president of the Plattsburgh Alumni Association. Heidi Kelly, chair of the University Council. Michael Cashman, a member of the University Council and supervisor of the town of Plattsburgh. Corey Jackson, interim vice president of enrollment and student services. Allison Hurd, vice president, diversity, equity, and inclusion. Todd Morovic, Interim Vice President, Administration and Finance. Dr. Denise Samard, Dean of the School of Education and Human Services. 
Dr. Brian Neuruther, Dean of the School of Business and Economics. Dr. Meg Pearson, Dean of the School of Arts and Sciences. Anne Whitmore Hansen, Vice President, Institutional Advancement. Dr. Sandra Rizak, Chair and Associate Professor of Sociology and Presiding Officer of the Faculty. And finally, Dr. Ray Carmen, Associate Professor of Political Science and Chair of the Faculty Senate. Please join me in welcoming our platform zest. We would not be here today if it were not for the scholars, the teachers, and the mentors who have supported our graduates throughout their entire educational journey. I would like for all of us to recognize the faculty and professional staff who have guided this class through a rigorous course of academic study and supported them throughout their entire university experience. Would the faculty and professional staff please stand? Graduates, this is your opportunity to show them your appreciation. Now I want to turn my attention to our purpose of today, celebrating our graduates. You are what today is all about. I want to thank you for attending SUNY Plattsburgh, and we are certainly a better place because of your presence on this beautiful campus. This semester, much of your experience was as it was back in your first days, but most of your time in higher ed has been incredibly tough. The class of 2023 bore as many challenges as any in recent memory. For most of you, a shift to remote learning took place in the spring of your very first year. Remember COVID testing, vaccinations, masking and more that became a part of your daily life for years? The university you experienced changed that very day as it did for each of us. Only this year has a return to regular rhythm taken place. No one in a century has faced the difficulties you have of a pandemic, the shift in expectations, and the dramatic altering of your coursework and university life. But here's the good news. You have persevered, you have overcome, which has caused for great celebration. So I ask everyone to give these graduates a very special round of applause. Graduates, you have demonstrated what Cardinal Strong truly means. Your peers here today and those watching by live stream commend you and celebrate with you. We are very, very proud of you. Many of you arrive with a general idea of, as to a possible career path. Others didn't know what you wanted to do, but you knew that a university education was the key to your success. As you leave today, you are now educated and equipped with critical thinking skills that will help prepare you. You are career ready thanks to your own dedication and hard work along with all of those who have invested in you during this journey. I also want to commend you for your activism and attention on matters of equity, belonging, and social justice. Your role in this gr growing effort has been critical. I have great confidence you will each contribute to make our world a better place for yourselves, for your families, and for generations to come. That is what cardinals do. I know you will take the opportunities and experience you've had and achieved very much. We're very proud of each of you who are graduating, especially our first generation students who are graduating today. So at this very moment, in this gymnasium, in front of your closest friends and family and loved ones, I want you to know how proud I am of your accomplishments. So once again, congratulations to each and every one of you. Congratulations. <laughs> At today's ceremony, I want to recognize among you a graduating senior, senior Nina Serafini, an English writing and language arts literature major from Schenectady, 
recipient of the prestigious Chancellor's Award for Academic Excellence. Nina, do you want to just wave to us? <laughs> Thanks. The Chancellor's Award recognizes outstanding achievement in areas including academics, leadership, campus involvement, community service, and the arts. Congratulations, Nina. At this time, I'll ask Provost Herzog to please join me at the lectern. We will now present the candidates for degrees because we believe each candidate should be formally and publicly recognized on this day of celebration, each will cross the stage to be congratulated. Dr. Tracy Guzio, Professor of English and Director of the Red K Honors Program, and Dr. Shauna Mefford Kelty, Associate Professor of Theater, will announce each graduate's name. Members of the University Council will present diploma covers to each of the candidates as their names are announced. Will the candidates for Master of Science, Certificate of Advanced Study, Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Fine Arts, and Bachelor of Science degrees please stand? <laughs> President Inyeti. On behalf of the faculty of the State University of New York at Plattsburgh, I am pleased to recommend these candidates be granted the bachelor's and master's degrees or certificates which they have earned. Thank you, Provost Herzog. On the recommendation of the outstanding faculty and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the trustees of the State University of New York, I hereby confer upon you the degree you have earned with all the rights, responsibilities, and privileges pertaining thereunto. Congratulations. Please be seated. The recipients of these degrees will now come forward by individual row. Please follow the directions on when to stand. Haley Parker. <laughs> Megan Farley. <laughs> Sierra Collins. Amanda Meach. Luke Brichetti. Kaylin Snyder. Hannah Seeger. Christine Lurkies. Karen Gouldhebert. <laughs> Jessica Pelkey. <laughs> Lauren Lamink. <laughs> Andrew Shelak. Helen Hogan, magna cum laude. <laughs> Natalia Quinones, magna cum laude. <laughs> Alexa Dumas, magna cum laude. <laughs> Nina Serafini, summa cum laude. 
Christina Plummer. Sophia Lebron, magna cum laude. Michael Craig Casey. Elijah Crossborn, magna cum laude. Amy Heimowitz. Stephen Dixon, Jr. <laughs> Devin DeSantis. <laughs> Ryan Martiz. <laughs> Rebecca Diller, summa cum laude. Megan Snyder, cum laude. Chloe Smith, cum laude. Mallory Brownwell, summa cum laude. Joelle McCool, summa cum laude. Angelina Pelkey, Jasmine Piper, cum laude, Gabriel Thatcher, Reese Thompson, magna cum laude, Zachary Thomas Hart, summa cum laude. Shannon Cooper. Michaela Osmer, magna cum laude. Yurino Tan, cum laude. Charlize Guerra. Ixchel Granados. David Batista, cum laude. Hayden John Holly Ives. Cole Wiener. James Alexander. Rocky Bujaj. Gabrielle Pagano. Dara Ames, cum laude. Rafaela Bevilacqua. <laughs> Melissa Mendoza. <laughs> Jessica R. Johnson. <laughs> Kristen Panera. <laughs> Malaika Salim, summa cum laude. Geneva Sai. <laughs> Carmisha D. Felix, cum laude. <laughs> Jamal Dornelian. <laughs> Joseph Mason, summa cum laude. Yeah! Jeffrey Koff, magna cum laude. Yeah. Michaela Taylor. Yeah. 
Melissa Fort, magna cum laude. Patrick Pfeiffer. Edward Belarjan. Patrick Mahunik, Jr. Jillian Dendato. Cora Austin. Sarah Bussler. Carson Wallfield. Drew Wemple. Robert Apadola. Nicholas D'Amico. Danielle Crockett. Andrea Grace Ketsley. Gianna Morfisi. Jennifer Cruz. Suramain Dow. Joshua A. McLean. Justin Biviano. Juan Carlos Vargas. Benjamin Jones. Julia Shailene. Sierra Smith. Austin Audette Cum Laude. Emily Lord. Matthew Cartoon. Brianna Sierra Summa Cum Laude. <laughs> Maggie Jolliker, Magna Cum Laude. William Tenek Zakwa. Shaiku Joseph, cum laude. Munyan Roddy, Kalas Shimanye. Nathan Phillips. Michael Halopko. Jacob Benbennik. The mogul, Mikey Johnson. <laughs> Shakira Fisher. Kia Map. Lindsay Aldis. Katie Ransom, summa cum laude. Melanie Lanzo. Angeline Rodriguez.
Hilary Salazar. Esther Estrada. Kenneth Baez. Bruce Juno the Third. Samantha Sanzaro, cum laude. Kirsten Fury. Majik Flores. Olivia Settle. Alexander Sirico. Morgan Burns. Lindsay Bronfatel. Stefania Zelinsky. Emily Ebersol. Jahara Tennessee Seals. <laughs> Philip John Neller. <laughs> Emily Mazacone. <laughs> Maya Emerson. Okay, ja. Okay, ja. Rowan Arquette, cum laude. Paula Kukaida, cum laude. Joseph Cassiano. Katie Carter, cum laude. Enrique Modesto. Zawa Shamir Ahmed. Tram Nguyen. Sivaji Misunuri. Jessica Olszewski. Nelkis Molina. Nelkis Molina. Caitlin Goodwin. Jenna Combs. Fardia Desir, cum laude. Fatim Haidara. Lucas Corbo. Tyler Smith. Taylor Edgar, summa cum laude. Alexander Marr. Eric Salo. Michael Corsi. Aiden Manning. Eric Azer.
Angelo Siniscali. Emily McLynn. Kelsey Hagley Alexander. Max Myers. Daniel Cardito Cum Laude. Ryan Nista, magna cum laude. Daniel Grant. Gabriel Munkel, cum laude. Brandon Beato. Julian Pigliavento. Jack Bryan. Michael Swift. Carlo Lorenzetti. Cassandra Ashline. Cum laude. Catherine Vignone. Cum laude. Yancy Carter. Yade Rivera. Derek Samborski. Shannon Alea Brown. Lisa Ali. Isato Low. Sarah Mathurin. Abeowa Jessica Uzamewe. Olivia Bousquet, magna cum laude. Elizabeth Cochenda. Sydney Pearson Hakes, cum laude. Madeline Taylor, cum laude. Shannon Tracy. Celeste Considine. Brendan Blanco. Jason Coginos. Thomas Eugene O'Connor. Zachary Kahn. Aiden Crittenden. Ashley Barkley. Lindsay Adamitis. Emma McLaughlin. Lucas Rhodes. Sarah Crossneck, cum laude. Sierra Bar Benjamin. Tammy Tejas. Jayla Christina Roberts. 
Evelyn Grace Heyer, cum laude. Nadia Naheem, cum laude. Emily Estes. Gray Norbordo. Alicia Murphy. Sadana Duye. Alexandra May Cambria. Brexton Montville. Brett Goldberg. Julianne Rahner. Jeffrey Kusi. Amanrat Ashmo, summa cum laude. Nele Vaita, cum laude. Alexis Fitzpatrick. Adam Brunel, magna cum laude. Eric Monestime. Joshua Lawton, magna cum laude. Shane Westphalen, cum laude. Dylan Sowers, cum laude. Elizabeth Maratz. Karen Fuji, summa cum laude. Anderson Carroll. Gabriel Monroe. Oliver Riel. Nathaniel Bryson. Andrew Jason Alsin, cum laude. Kelly Donovan. Samantha Hopkins. Julia Ennis. Nicholas Provost. Mike West. Zachary Ronas, cum laude. Maya Franklin. Kaya Lofton. Quintaya Lee. Charisse, Charlize Talaya Steven. Amelia Stevens. <laughs> Rachel Hofstadter. <laughs> Kristen Lasoe, magna cum laude. <laughs> Matthew Foy. Shay Manor, cum laude. Destiny Perez.
Amoni Kalabor. Tyler Cozio. Shahidul Islam. Andrew Broll. Danielle Baker. Michaela Rothermel. Eric Steckler. Alex Mercier. Zachary Smith. The one and only Justice Hall. <laughs> Taija Neal. Yaseli Sandoval. Daniela Raymond. <laughs> Ashley Ortega. <laughs> Tamisha Bell. <laughs> Vincent Michael Fredericks. <laughs> Cum laude. Arben Nezai, summa cum laude. Connor O'Neill. Zachary Niles. Samuel Atuhini. <laughs> Shelby Penelope Disla Pena. <laughs> Nicholas Cousins. <laughs> Austin Duquette. Peter Ashfield. Jason Lynch, cum laude. Kiana Ceballos. Allison Mazanek. Mustafa Atwi, cum laude. <laughs> Divik Patel. <laughs> Ohima Owusu Poku. Yolson Maristal. Jonathan Benjamin. Lauren Schmidt. Haley Ann Ortiz. Misa Dowdell. Maya Smith. <laughs> Hannah Roberto. <laughs> oh. 
Claudia Brown. Triana Von Elba, cum laude. Summerlee Delia. Augusta Kramer. Rebecca Deep. Brandy Millsap. Paige Blonda. Caitlin Kennedy. Rhoda Sintim Ajiman. Evans Kujo, cum laude. Rodney Benjamin. Emmanuel Ebanqua. Barbara Cueno. Mary Schoolin Torin, summa cum laude. Ashla, Ashley Bear, cum laude. Charlotte Stevens, cum laude. Maclete Fasil Mulalem. Magna cum laude. Bamlak Fasil Zodi. Elizabeth Scarinci. Jack Test. Killian Krogan. Congratulations, graduates. Congratulations, Cardinals. It is a tradition at SUNY Plattsburgh for a member of the graduating class to be our featured speaker at this momentous occasion. Today, senior Malika Salim, a biomedical sciences major from Port Henry, will be addressing you. Salim is also minoring in chemistry and has served as a public relations officer for the Pre-Med Pre-Health Association a peer mentor for the honors program, and has partnered with Dr. Nana Ankara, assistant professor in biological sciences for independent research. She is the recipient of numerous awards, including the Suds and Monk Outstanding Senior Award and the Philip Walker Undergraduate Research Award in Biology. Please join me in welcoming Malika as today's 
Please join me in joining and welcoming Malaika as today's featured speaker. Malaika, the floor is yours. <laughs> Thank you, President Inyeti, and distinguished platform guests. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, family, friends, faculty, and most especially those graduating today, to whom I offer my sincerest congratulations. I am honored and humbled to address you on behalf of the graduating class of 2023. When I pictured graduation, I can guarantee you it did not include me being the student speaker. Having to reflect on the past few years of life at Plattsburgh is not an easy task, nor does my time limit give SUNY Plattsburgh all the credit it deserves. But still, I'll try my best. While touring the university during my senior year of high school, it was the alluring landscape that reeled me in. From the brick buildings, the autumn trees, the pond gleaming be between Hudson and Hawkins Hall, SUNY Plattsburgh provides a beautiful atmosphere for anyone willing to learn and grow. But I soon came to realize that it is not the buildings nor the changing of the seasons that has made SUNY Plattsburgh an unforgettable home over the past three years. Rather, it is the community of people who make this small university such a special place. From the professors who provide us with guidance to the custodial staff who wish us good luck on exams in the morning, the people are what makes SUNY Plattsburgh a forever memorable home. Among the faculty and staff are some of the more unsung heroes on our campus. We all have professors and faculty members who have gone above and beyond to help ensure our success here at Plattsburgh. For me, those people were Dr. Donald Slish, Dr. Nana Ankra, and Ms. Laura Kronk. <laughs> I would like to personally thank them for all they have done to help me flourish. Dr. Slish, constantly helped me put things into perspective <laughs> and prepared me for a great future, as I am sure all your advisors have done. Ms. Laura Kronk, who is the Extended Time Testing Coordinator here at Plattsburgh, provides hundreds of students with a welcoming environment and is always open to talking when things become stressful. And we all have had a special professor who has pushed us to challenge ourselves. Mine is Dr. Nana Ankra. Dr. Ank Thank you, Dr. Ankra, for being a supportive mentor who always believed in me and for sh showing up to research with a smile, even when I accidentally released swarms of flies into the lab on multiple occasions. <laughs> Along with professors and faculty, we owe a great thanks to our families and friends. Throughout our lives, families teach us to distinguish the good from the bad. They help us pursue our goals and make sure we do not face any hurdles alone. The role of our families in our lives is immeasurable. I would like to take this moment to honor my parents, mom and dad. I took advantage <laughs> Mom and Dad, I took advantage of every opportunity in my path because you gave me the confidence to do so. I understand how privileged I am because I have watched you appreciate the little things. Although I am the one who did the assignments and took the exams, you are the ones who answered my calls in the middle of the night when I would be stressing about them. More so my dad than my mom. Thank you for always encouraging me and supporting me. Without you, my graduation would not have been possible. Whoever those people are to you, whether your parents, grandparents, guardians, or friends, 
Do not forget to thank them for the sacrifices they have made to put you in these seats. Those sacrifices were made so that we all could receive an education, but there is more to getting a good education than simply attending classes and taking exams. Being a SUNY Plattsburgh student has meant getting lost and finding your way through Yoakum Hall, because let's face it, that building makes absolutely no sense at all. <laughs> it meant becoming friends with unexpected people who you would grow to love as family. And for me personally, attending Plattsburgh State meant setting the air fryer on fire just because I wanted a midnight snack that I never even got to enjoy. <laughs> there are many valuable lessons we've gained from our collective experiences at Plattsburgh. As I progressed through my time here, I learned the value of empathy and utilizing the skills and career opportunities that a university degree provides to make a positive contribution to society. A famous author summarizes this well. If you choose to use your status and influence to raise your voice on behalf of those who have no voice, if you choose to identify with not only the powerful, but with the powerless, if you retain the ability to imagine yourself into the lives of those who do not have your advantages, then it will not only be your proud families who celebrate your existence, but thousands and millions of people whose reality you've helped transform for the better. I believe one of the most ordinary lessons we learn is about making a difference in the lives of others. But it is the ordinary lessons that we take for granted that can be the most priceless and special of all. Therefore, as you progress to bigger and better things, make those little things extraordinary. Thank you, and congratulations, graduates. Just a little bit more. I wish you the best of luck on your future endeavors. <laughs> Thank you, Malaika. It's now my pleasure to introduce Teba Azim, president of the SUNY Plattsburgh Student Association. Teba? Good afternoon, Cardinals. <laughs> Thank you, Michael. With your matriculation into SUNY Plattsburgh came with its membership into the Student Association. You will no longer be students. You will now take on an important role to our current student body as role models. They will look to you for leadership, success, and most of all, a sense of passion for this beautiful place that is SUNY Plattsburgh, the place that now you can officially call your alma mater. Together, as cardinals, it's time for us to leave this nest spread our wings, and soar onwards. Today, I'm honored to have been conferred the rights by the virtue of the Office of Student Association President to help mark this passage for the class of 2023. Please rise. On the count of three, please join me in moving your tassel from right side of your motor board to the left, over your heart, the true home for your alma mater, SUNY Plattsburgh. One. Two. Three.
Congratulations, class of 2023. We are so proud of you. Thank you. Thank you, Teba. It is now my pleasure to introduce Matthew Veach, a 1994 alumnus of SUNY Plattsburgh and the first vice president of the SUNY Plattsburgh Alumni Association. Matt? Thank you, President Agnetti. On behalf of the Plattsburgh Alumni Association, it is my pleasure to congratulate the class of 2023. The Plattsburgh Alumni Association is the official organization of the college's more than 72,000 alumni. Our mission is to enhance alumni connections with the university and to actively support the SUNY Plattsburgh student experience, especially with regard to career and life preparation. I speak for my colleagues on the alumni board when I offer you our sincere congratulations. We are most hopeful that you will continue your involvement with your alma mater. You have an important role as alumni of SUNY Plattsburgh. We hope you will help us to ensure students following in your footsteps will also enjoy the Plattsburgh experience we are celebrating today. So stay in touch and come back for your first homecoming weekend, October 13th and 14th, 2023. Congratulations again and welcome to the Plattsburgh Alumni Association. Thank you, Matt. Let me end this ceremony by wishing each of our graduates much success in your careers and your lives. You entered today as students, and now you will leave as graduates. And I encourage you to take the time to see a professor or a mentor who is here today before you leave. I'd also like to thank the following individuals who helped support today's events. Our faculty marshal, Dr. Muhammad Gaber, SUNY Distinguished Service Professor of Accounting and recipient of the University Council of its Distinguished Service Award. Thank you, Dr. Gaber. <laughs> Our wonderful bagpipers, the Montreal RCMP Pipes and Drums, thank you for being here. And to the many faculty and professional staff who volunteered to assist today, we couldn't have done it without you. So thank you very much as well. And finally, to our guests, families, loved ones, significant others, thank you for attending. You, what, you are what made this a special event today. So thank you for being here. So, please wait until the graduates, faculty, and platform party have left. Then you may go out outside to meet your family on the grass. I will find you. I will be in your pictures. So I'm looking forward to meeting you all one-on-one. -on -one. <laughs> With that, thank you very much. Congratulations, graduates. Cardinals, you did it.
Contact Radio.